Today we are hanging out with the Griffins and, very exclusively, one of the snitches! Hey Walt! Walt is one of the snitches for Global Games tomorrow. He's staying at Rebecca's place just like I am. So this is a graveyard right here. You can't really see it because there are no actual graves, but there are like markings. The reason why this is relevant is because us Griffins are doing something quite creepy today. So we've got a couple of Griffins right here. Hey Griffins! Uh, that over there is Walt. Walt is a snitch. For Global Games, he's tagging along. And so it's Sandra, our friend from Denmark. Hi. Hey! Now, what are we doing and why are we here? Well, we're all kind of Supernatural fans. A lot of Supernatural, the series, is filmed in Vancouver. And today we're kind of breaking the law a bit because there's a psychiatric hospital nearby, an abandoned one, that got featured a lot in the series. We want to see that from the inside. We might shit our pants, we might get busted by the police, we don't really, really know what we're doing to be honest, it's all kind of improv. But it seemed like a pretty cool adventure. Okay, I swear to god, this place is so fucking creepy. Why are we doing this? Why are we doing this voluntarily? Is anything in? Oh man, I swear to god, if something comes out, I'm gonna <laughs> shit so myself. Creepy inside, oh man. my god. See that? That's a crime scene. Point. It's a psychiatric institution. We found the crazy people asylum. On a side note, we also found that this is apparently a breeding ground for camera type people. So we might actually be walking into a supernatural set active right now. Oh, by the way, we found something really cool. Caution, do not enter. Okay, so we're still on the premises. Trying to figure out a way to go inside. It all looks pretty creepy and, and abandoned and everything. I mean, like, look at the fucking place. How creepy can you get, right? And we are definitely sure something's going on. Because as you can see, there was a light inside. So we're trying to get to the main entrance right now. Oh, hang on, somebody was screaming. Hang on. And the other one so is that guy... The guy with the dog just kind of told us that there's no way inside and that the movie crew is busy doing shit So we might not be getting inside nor shall we stumble upon a set because we don't want to fuck up their filming of course because we're nice people Very very nice slightly illegally trespassing people. Okay, so another creepy part of another creepy building This is all very much abandoned and right now we're gonna try and make an effort to maybe get in one of the windows. If one of my daughters ever gets a tattoo, it will be a tattoo of the following words just right above her vagina. <laughs> so tiny things that make this entire place better is the bits and pieces of graffiti that people left behind, like this. But this one's pretty cool as well. Don't look behind you. <laughs> um. Last attempt, because you have to go to practice. Last attempt to try and get inside. I'm gonna try to break the door down. I'm gonna try to break the door down. Sorry, I'm excited. Come on, girl. Where are your gloves? Yeah. Fuck the gloves, I'm hardcore. What about the, 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 the fingerprints? Fuck fingerprints, it's... Never, nobody's gonna... What? <laughs> nobody's gonna notice this. Stop killing my vibe. We didn't get in, but at least I made love to hardwood. <laughs> uh, okay, not happening. Oh well. On the bright side, thank you, Laura. I love you, Laura. On the bright side, Lizzie over here has made our Griffins' mark on the world. Where are we somewhere? Over there? Yeah. Look at that. We didn't get in, but the Griffins were here. Everybody will know this now. The Griffins have been near a psychiatric institution. That sounded better in my head, to be honest. So that was that. I talked to one of the people in a production building nearby, kind of stumbled upon it. Apparently they're filming something called Untold Stories of the ER, and it should be airing soon in uh, the States and Canada and a couple of other countries, but they couldn't tell us any more than that. Um, so we're heading back to practice now. So practice with us you was pretty cool. Uh, we made a couple of new friends. Obviously I didn't film it because I don't want to like divulge any secrets. Um, our jerseys just arrived, so look at this beautiful baby. Nice claw on the side. And this is just like, I just had to turn on the camera. This is a beautiful, perfect 
team moment right now. Like everybody's eating. I'm never like I'm never. I'm, I'm always hungry. I'm always hungry. Like everybody's eating, everybody's having fun together. There's a great sense of unity. Basically, this is just a team coming together beautifully and ready to kick some ass. I'm feeling pretty good. Spicy pizza. Spicy pizza. Belgium, how happy are you with the jerseys? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Everybody, Belgium, twerk. Twerk? You need to show the jersey to the camera. Twerk. Okay, so... Like, wait, hi, wait, oh wait, hit five. Can you turn around a bit? No. Yeah. And another time? Yeah. Show the front and the side. Show the sleeves. Look at that. My number. Our beautiful two models, Pauline and Yana. Yeah, like really, like... The funkiest bitches. Look at that. Look at that flow. Now kiss. Not you wish. Oh wait, what? Whoa, wait, what? What did you? Not in front of the camera. What? What? We gave him a press to do it. So. It's amazing. It's amazing. I don't have mine on me, but. Oh, wait, you can pretend. Yeah. Pretend. So we're gonna go off camera now, and funky things are gonna Hurry. be happening. Oh Video. Bro Rebecca, <laughs> coach for Canada. Your secret weapon seems to be an ice bath. <laughs> it's okay. so if, if he moves his legs. The hairs go back and forth like tiny jellyfish. So you're on top of the fridge now. Are you okay? Is it is it cold enough for you? A little bit. How are your balls doing? Not so good. <laughs> Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Remember the conversation we had about things retracting into your throat? Yeah. Yeah. You know, you don't sound that different <laughs> for someone who has balls in their throat. <laughs> Christian Bale voice. Oh, I'm Batman. Gargling marbles. <laughs> Don't you mean Bathman? <laughs> <laughs> one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Well, we're getting this, are we? Alright, one, two, three. Three. One, two, three. Such dramatic movements every time. Team UK. Team USA. By the way, this vlog has been brought to you by Megabyte Pizza <laughs> and Skytrain.